Hello guys, Keep On TV here, back for yet another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about Craig Gardner. Now, of course, Craig Gardner is going to be leaving the club. Um, and it's a real shame to see him leave the club, but it had to happen, to be honest. Um, since he's come in um, on his second return to Birmingham City from West Brom, um, he signed on a loan deal to the end of the season, then it was made permanent. But he's been at the club in his second spell for three years and he hasn't done much to be honest I know he hasn't well hang on uh, about two and a half years um, because he hasn't hardly been playing this season um, and it's just a shame to see him leave the club I think he's going to be a first team coach to Pet Clotet because he did mention that last summer that he's going to be um, playing as a co player coach this season so that's what he's done um, he's a Blues legend in my eyes. He's scored 16 goals for the club. He's got a lot of appearances for Blues as well. And um, yeah, he scored that goal against West... The goal that stands out for me at his time at Blues was that goal against West Ham in the Carling Cup semi-final. It was called the Carling Cup back then. That uh, made us get to Wembley. Um, and when he first signed for Blues, it was January 2010. He came in from Aston Villa. And uh, he hit the ground running. Um, you know, it, it's just mad to see how he's declined. Even when he was at West Brom, before we bought him, though, from West Brom, he was scoring free kicks. He still had that, uh, you know, uh, good. he had something good about him still. He could still smash free kicks in from range, but it's an end of an era, to be honest. Um, we're only going to have one gardener now at the club, and that's going to be Gary Gardner. Um, but, of course, he's 33 now, and... Uh, yeah, he was getting on in age. Um, he's at an age now where he can't really rediscover his form um, that he had for Blues earlier on uh, when he signed for the first time. Uh, he's got a couple of penalties for us um, since he's returned um, for the second time. He scored that penalty against Huddersfield as well, which was a massive um, penalty because it helped us stay up. Um, we was one nil up. We was uh, one nil up in the game, but that game, that uh, goal, sorry, from the penalty spot from Craig Gardner helped kill the game off. He's been a real leader in the dressing room as well. It's gonna be a shame to see him not actually on the football pitch, but he's gonna be still at the club, still around the players, and um, yeah, Craig Gardner is gonna be uh, leaving Blues as a player. Um, well, I think he's retiring. Yeah, he's retiring. Um, and it's a shame to see but in a way it's a kind of a good thing because there was no way that uh, he could play on for another season he was declining rapidly and um, when's the last time he had a good game for Blues leave it down in the comments below but anyway guys that's just been a quick video talking about Craig Gardner he's going to be a first team coach now so you know he's still got that experience in the dressing room and hopefully next season he can make an impact with Pep Clotet and we can get promotion to Premier League or at least challenge for promotion. But anyway guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, share, subscribe and keep on TV. Leave your thoughts down in the comments below. What do you think about Craig Garner leaving Birmingham City? Um, yeah, keep right on.